Johnny Depp and Peter DeLuise, two relative newcomers to television, <laughs> star as cops who poses as high school students. Congratulations. This Thank thing's you. going real good. Thank you very much. So far, it's been pretty good, yeah. Do you guys think of this as a cop show? Cop show? Young people show. Is that right? It's not, it's not uh, your everyday cop show. It's not uh, go out, shoot guns, and... It's you know, not, it's not rob freeze banks. or I'll drop it. It's more hmm. like... Who are you taking to the prom? <laughs> <laughs> it's a cerebral cop show. It's sort of a flavor, cerebral right? Yeah. yeah, that's a good one. It's you a like, cerebral cop show. You like show. that one. Let me, let me ask you this. The, the gentleman who plays um, your captain on the program, Steve Williams. Steve Williams, yeah. Said that in order to get into his part, he went out on a three to midnight shift with the local police for a while. What'd you do to research? I mean, well, that's, guys little, that's overkill, right? Really? That's a little overkill. See, we just, we went to high school, right? Steven yeah. can't remember high school. <laughs> Stephen is Stephen is, Stephen is is a veteran actor. Okay, he's yes, he's, been he's much older than you guys. He's been but, yeah. but what, are you, what are you saying that that what was important for you to get into a role was just remembering experiences of high school as opposed to, to well, being real cops? It's not it's not really about being a cop. It's about people and relationships in high school and about growing up. Yeah, that's why it's a successful show. If it was about cops, it'd be like every other cop show. Yeah. So getting into the role was more like examining relationships between people, which you do every day anyway. Is it true that when you were first approached, you didn't want any part of this show? Yeah. Why? Wait, well, watch, uh, watch what you say now. I'm, I'm going to be very careful. Okay. The way. Uh, when I first uh, uh, read or got a hold of the script, I had just gotten back from the Philippines. I had done Platoon. So uh, at the time, I really didn't want to do like a television series. You thought it was beneath you? Not necessarily beneath me. Close. I just didn't want to be stuck in something I was going to be doing for like six years, you know? Yeah. But then I read the script. This is what I'm going to save it. Okay. Wait. All right. Okay. <laughs> then I read the script, and uh, I, I thought it was real good. I thought it was very good, and I thought there was a lot of strong messages, and uh, I felt like I wanted to do something like that. Yeah. And that's when I, I tested, and I was on a plane the next day to Vancouver, and I did it. You jumped on it right away, but you were twice the person you are now. So I was a little heavier. Yeah, you were a lot heavier. They, I mean, they came in, they conveyed the role to me as a John Candy type role. Yeah, you were supposed to be big, jocular, happy-go-lucky. But you weren't that big. You weren't. No, he was kind of big. I was, was big. I read he was 275. Uh, I, no. Well, that, was, that wasn't during the first season of the show. First season of the show, I was 235. And then I dropped 40 pounds uh -huh. during the first and second That sit well with the producers? No, they, they, they kind of did a double take and said, you know, didn't you read they the inquiry? They cheated, right? the inquiry? No, I didn't read the inquiry. The inquiry thing said, no, you Peter Deloise, Peter Deloise, 21 Jump Street, drops 95 pounds in one week. Yeah. They, they got the story a little wrong. <laughs> Cut off a couple of legs. Yeah. Look, I mean, I noted at the top that, that your show deals with um, some sensitive subjects. I mean, and for example, you, you, the episode this coming Sunday deals with AIDS. How much say do you have in, in the scripts? Well, we have to digest the dialogue first, you know, yeah, before I mean, you get it. Mm -hmm. yeah. We see it on paper and we say, well, this doesn't sit well. But you'll never go to them and say, hey, look, this is what they're talking about in my neighborhood or this is something I experienced. Oh, we suggest, oh, sure, we suggest, you know, till the cows come home. I mean, if, it, if, if we read it and it doesn't seem like it's real and it's not, wouldn't, wouldn't have actually happened, then we mm. say, come yeah, we on. Have, we have a lot of input because we're, we're closer to being teenagers than any writer on the show because they're 30 and we're... Not. And you're yes. not, yeah. Uh, the, the, um, the show also is unusual in that certain episodes are followed by a PSA. For example, the one about AIDS is followed by a PSA on AIDS. How important are those to, to the working of the program and the success of the program? I think, I think they're, they're very important because they, uh, they draw, we've been able to draw a lot of numbers. Uh, I mean, not as far as ratings, I'm saying. The, the numbers that we send out, the 800 numbers for the, the PSAs. Numbers. Yeah. Uh, I've been able the to get we've gotten a lot of responses yeah. uh, from certain shows that we've done on crack or, or uh, child molestation and things like that, and the AIDS show is mm. coming up this Sunday. Let me talk about your futures a little bit. What's your dad think of what you do? Very proud of me. Really? Yeah, he's very supportive. Any thoughts of getting into the kind of comedy acting that he's best known for? Sure. Is that what you'd like to do? Yes. <laughs> 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 Johnny, what about you? I mean, you got good notices for Platoon. Can, is, is that where your future is, or are you going to be happy with the small screen? Uh, I'd like to do both. I don't want to just settle for one. I'd like to do both. I'd like to keep features going as well as uh, the show. Yeah? Yeah. How long? I mean, you're now, you're going to be 25 pretty soon. You're 21. 21. Yeah, babies. How, how much longer can the two of you pose as high school students? How much longer? <laughs> you're watching yes. the show. Peter Delaware, Johnny Depp, we're looking for a job. 
anybody. <laughs> you see the show, we're up for hire. You know. <laughs> that go for you too? Yes. Oh, yes okay. Yeah. Well, you're right. You're right. That sometimes the you outgrow a show. Well, yeah. Stephen Williams is the only one with a secure job, right? Pretty much. He's, yeah. the, he's um, a captain. Well, maybe you're kept after a couple. Catherine of Deneuve is coming up, isn't she? Yes, she is. She's in the green room. She we want to meet her. Though. Good. Oh, <laughs> sit, sit right there. She's standing right over. She'll be stepping in just oh. a moment. Eight, uh oh. Eight forty. <laughs> that camera swung around. <laughs> Eight forty-four. We're back in a moment after this.